Hello, my name is Ron Sampson. I'd like to introduce you to uh, the school where I teach, uh, Henan Experimental High School in Zhengzhou, Henan Province. Uh, Zhengzhou is a large industrial city of about 7 million people in north central China, about two and a half hour fast train ride from Beijing. Uh, so, without any further ado, I'd like to introduce you to some parts of the campus, a little bit about our program as well. We're a, a Sino-Canadian, Nova Scotia curriculum-based uh, program. Uh, so come on in, let's have a look. Hello, my name is Bernie McIntyre and I'm the principal of the Sino-Canadian program here at Henan Experimental High School. I'm just complete, completing my eighth year as principal here. Came for two years and uh, actually ended up staying for eight. And uh, the main reason that I've lasted this long is because of the wonderful students that we have here. It's a great place to teach. You have students who are highly motivated, who are very kind, and create pretty well no discipline problems for teachers. Teachers are able to come here and teach without having to worry about dealing with uh, discipline uh, every day or even uh, uh, on occasion. Actually, it's very rare that there is an issue between the, the teachers and the students. So thank you very much, and uh, I hope some of you will decide to uh, make the journey here. Uh, my name is Angie and I work in Sino-Canadian program in Honan Experimental High School. My job is help new teachers. If they have any problem, just come to see me and I will try my best to help them. Hello, my name is Song and I'm working in Honan Experimental High School International Department. My job is to bring you the foreign teachers from your home to Zhengzhou and uh, I'm waiting for you here. Grade 11 history class. Global geography. And Grade 10 English. And repetition to make the setting reflect Della's mood. Chemistry 12 lab. Physics lab. This is the Learning Resources Center, uh, commonly referred to as the LRC, a fully equipped computer lab, very large area, sometimes we have drama class. Looking at the front of our building, main school campus, uh, I'm standing in a little park. It's a really quaint, interesting little park, uh, all kinds of different trees, different uh, features to it. Uh, there's also a quiet sitting, standing on the back of the school. Uh, near the back gate of our campus. Uh, I'm, I'm also on the soccer field, the track field. Um, wonderful facility. This fighter jet is a symbol of the aviation program that the province has established here. Hi, my name is Karen. I'm from Nova Scotia in Canada and I've been at HEHS for two years. The things I love most about this school are that we have a big foreign staff, we get to experience a lot of new culture and also learn from our students as well as teach them. The students are amazing and really easy to work with and hardworking. As for Zhengzhou, the city, it's very central in China and easy to travel. We've gone a lot of places. And as for teaching in China, it's just overall a great experience and a great learning experience for everybody. Hello, my name is Ezekiel Ian Yombo. I'm from Uganda. I've been here for more than three years. I like the life here, I like the students. I think it's an honor to teach here and these great uh, workmates, colleagues. The administration is good and very interesting to work with the Chinese people. I'm Doris and I'm from 11D in the Sound Opinion program. So, so what I hope to see between the new foreign teachers and students are the good communication and interactions uh, and to build a good interrelationship. Hi everyone, this is Yifei from 12C. Uh, I'm going to graduate this year and attend a college. Uh, well, what I like about this program is that we actually have the chance to attend a college and university is abroad. We have the opportunity to meet and learn with the teachers from a foreign country and we learn uh, all the things about them, like the lives we will have in a foreign country.
Uh, hello, I'm Neil from 12D, and uh, I regard my life in this program as a transition that connects my uh, school life in China and the school life in Canada. Uh, it, it well prepares me for the challenges in universities. And I think enthusiasm is the uh, most important uh, quality that we are looking for in our foreign teachers. Teachers have, have to be passionate uh, about students and about their teaching careers. Um, hi, I'm Jack. I'm a grade 11 student from Class E in this Sino-Canadian program. And it is my pleasure to study in this program because it provides me with a lot of opportunities to work with foreign teachers. Uh, the characteris characteristics I look forward to in my foreign teacher is uh, maybe they can spend more time talking about uh, college level researches, uh, how to talk with people from different backgrounds and how to uh, learn to accept different conventions and traditions. And also I believe maybe they can work with students more individually so that uh, different needs could be satisfied. Standing outside the back gate, as where most of the foreign teachers come to buy fruits and vegetables at the market, uh, you can pretty well get anything you want here. <laughs> As you can see, fruit from everywhere, lots of variety. Hello! Hello! <laughs> Seafood, poultry. Hi, got a suit There are literally thousands of small restaurants all along, everywhere, the base of most of these tall buildings. Great area to go and taste the local cuisine. And of course, uh, one of the most popular stores in all of China is probably the dentist store, a uh, Kangel store. That's our shop where uh, most of us get our dry cleaning done. A tour of our school neighborhood wouldn't be complete without a stop at Zach's Barbecue. It's a little American pub owned by, of course, an American. Uh, in here you can get pretty well all comforts at home. You can get barbecue ribs and burgers and pizza. So here you, we have what's commonly referred to as the 360 Mall. It's where all of the shops are. There's a great gym here. Pizza Hut. Uh, KFC for if you're so inclined. Starbucks, etc. Oh, it's an apartment building. As you can see, there's a, an elevator which is a, a laid out. It's a three bedroom apartment. All of our apartments have the same furniture sofa, armchairs, TVs, lamps, kitchens have full set of pots and pans, utensils, flat cook top, very efficient. One of the rooms, of course, can be used as a kitchen, as the kit, as the dining room kitchen. Everybody gets a microwave and a toaster oven. Toaster oven, of course. It's amazing what you find to cook in these things. So, lots of furniture. The three-bedroom apartments are fairly spacious. And, of course, What's a tour of an apartment without having a look at the bathroom? The bathrooms are all uh, very similar. Uh, they have the washing machine, western toilet, sink, and of course the Asian concept of taking a shower in the open with no stall, the water runs on the floor, drain is over by the washing machine. Hey, I'm Ron Sampson again. I will be the principal for the academic year 2017-2018. Uh, it's been my pleasure to show you around the Hunan Experimental High School campus and uh, for me to introduce the program to you. I, I 
certainly hope to see you uh, on our campus, perhaps working with us and uh, enjoying Zhengzhou, China. Thank you.